with tea quilts and I went to the post office today and received something in the mail so I just thought that I would go ahead and do this portion so that I'm not holding off to the end of the month and if I get any additional things in my mailbox this month then I will add them at the end so I received this package from Phyllis Garner out of North Carolina and Figure out the best way to get in here. <laughs> oh, wow. So it's got some fabric in here. And I'm just going to take everything out of the box for right now. And then I will read what it says. <laughs> Hi T. The Florence and Michael Hurricane stopped me from saying I appreciate all the time you put into sharing your gift with us. Valuable lessons. Here is some fabric for wide backing. Three yards of 108 inches wide and about 10 yards of 44 inch panel backing and then she says p.s also several blocks for the quilt charity quilt so thank you so much phyllis i appreciate you doing this because i am getting to the point where now it's time for me to quilt the quilts and so just trying to get things to put on the backs of them is a challenge so i appreciate you sending that and then i want to go ahead and show you her blocks first she sent two blocks she's got a um, straight crumb block it's very pretty and then she also did a true crazy quilt block where she did some machine stitches she did different stitches over some of the blocks so very pretty again and I will bring it up close just so you can see some of the machine stitching that she did just beautiful work thank you so much Phyllis and then this one here she was saying is 10 yards it's a blue and it's 44 inches wide so I will definitely piece this to go on a back and then she also sent a backing that is 108 wide that she says is three yards so that is pretty cool and I really 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 appreciate this Phyllis because <laughs> it's just more than a notion to have to piece the backs after I'm also doing the fronts too so I appreciate you donating some backs to me so that I can get them done a little faster and then this one would only be one seam that I would have to make over all of the smaller pieces that I have already in my backing stash so I really appreciate that so thank you so much I'm just going to go ahead and end the video here just in case I don't get anything else in the mail but if so then I'll just add on to this video but thank you all so much for watching if you're interested in sending or donating to the charity quilt fun my birthday block challenge you can get my email information down in the description box of any video but thank you so much and i will see you all next time bye bye everybody